food security. This presentation provides an overview of food security as a new public health issue in global context and in Australia. Using the Red Lotus model of health and well-being as a guide, it describes and enlists the determinants of health. About 821 million people, approximately one out of every nine people in the world are undernourished of which nearly 151 million children under 5 have stunted growth while the lives of 50 million children continues to be threatened by wasting as of 2017. Food security is defined as access by all people at all times to enough food for an active healthy life whereas food insecurity exists and is defined as whenever the availability of nutritionally adequate and safe foods or the ability to acquire acceptable food in socially acceptable ways is limited and uncertain. Food security is a state when all people have physical and economic access to sufficient, safe and nutritious food to meet their dietary need and food preferences for healthy life and sustainability. Multidimensional nature of food security includes availability, accessibility, stability and utilization. In Australia, it was 30% more expensive to buy basic nutritious food in rural and remote areas than in urban and metropolitan areas in 2006. According to Australian Institute of Family Studies 2008, the prevalence of food insecurity among Australian population is estimated at 5%, of which 40% are at severe level, 63% of Australian adults and 25% of children were classified as overweight or obese in 2011 and 2012. According to the Australian National Nutrition Survey, and the Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander Health Performance Framework, there were certain groups who experienced food insecurity at a higher rate than the general population. These groups include Indigenous people 24%, Unemployed people 23%, Single Parent Household 23%, Low Income Earners 20%, Rental Households 20%, and Young People 15%. Also other people who are affected are culturally and linguistically diverse groups including refugees people with lack of access to transport, people who misuse alcohol and tobacco, people who are disabled, unwell and frail. There are many things that causes food insecurity, some of which are poverty, poor infrastructure, lack of social protection, water, poor education, individual poor management of skills, lack of access to reasonably priced foods, and many more. I will present nine determinants of food security in this presentation by using Red Lotus model of health and well-being as a guide. Red Lotus model is a part of a broader model representing a holistic, ecological, and salutogenic framework. It comprises of individual and environmental determinants of public health topic of food security. Individual determinants consist of biological, socioeconomic, behavioral, and cognitive factors. Higher prevalence of food insecurity has been reported among particularly marginalized communities as 71% of asylum seekers, Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people 22%, disadvantaged urban households 25%, and unemployed peoples 23%. 
the issues that impacts on the food security of remote Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander communities are irregular food supply, culturally inappropriate or non-nutritious food, people living in caravans, crisis in accommodation or homelessness, compromised ability to store or prepare food, and low educational attainment, poor food literacy. There are also negative health outcomes on children living in food insecure households as higher risk of particular birth defects, increased hospitalization, and iron deficiency anemia. Also, it affects among adults who experience food insecurity are increased risk of developing kidney disease, nutrient inadequacies, mental health issues, higher levels of risk factors for cardiovascular disease and diabetes. The environmental level determinants consist of natural, built, socio-economic and political environments. Under natural environment, the rising sea level increases the risk of flooding of agriculture land. Extreme climate variability causes flooding stresses, clean drinking water, and in addition, uptake of micronutrients in is adversely affected. Climate change brings warmer temperatures, changes to rainfall pat patterns, and increased frequency affecting the crop production. Seasonality influences the consumption of food as adequate consumption of vitamin A rich foods is hindered by seasonality as green leafy vegetables are abundant only in rainy season. Seasonal fluctuation affects agricultural production and the population relying on agriculture output with little access to animal source foods experience seasonal food shortages. Under a built environment, enhanced food access exposure and availability leads to healthier food intake. Access to large grocery stores or vendors leads to healthier diets that include more fruit and vegetables and fiber intake, whereas excess exposure to fast food restaurants and convenience type stores selling calorie dense foods might result in less healthy diet consumptions. Availability of public transport influence access to food stores, distant grocery stores and lack of transportation can force people to use close convenience stores to buy junk foods and less balanced meals. The socio-cultural and economic environmental factors include indigenous communities who have cultural values of hunting which has positive outcome and contributes to nutrition and food security. Food Basket Prices Survey had examined the association between food prices and categories of remoteness, essentially looking at the relative relationship between the location of a store and food prices, identified a relationship between food prices and remoteness in Queensland. In South Australia, it was demonstrated that food costs were higher in remote areas of that state. In Northern New South Wales, there was large differences in food prices between rural and urban locations. In Queensland, it was found that food prices had increased at a higher rate in remote and rural locations in Australia in comparison to urban locations. Intake of healthy diet is often affected by the taxes which are already applied at many points in the food supply chain. Example, to cultural inputs, transport of food, the companies that produce, process and market food and those who consume it. Several factors contribute to global and domestic food prices such as increased national pressure due to an uneven distribution of global food stocks accelerating demand for animal source food commodities particularly among urban middle class is pushing up prices affecting food security therefore political factors also plays an important role in food insecurity 
social justice generally refers to the idea of creating an equilateral society or institution that is based on the principles of equality and solidarity that understands and values human rights and that recognizes the dignity of every human being people living in rural areas cannot access to quality food compared to urban area due to lack of transportation distribution of grocery store and low socioeconomic status people with low income source cannot access to quality food compared to high income source there is prevalence of food insecurity among aboriginal and torres strait islander people indigenous people and many other groups as described here in this presentation due to this many different causes as poverty lack of education and lack of access this clearly shows the prevalence of social injustice among the people approaches enhancing factors supporting human health and well-being is known as salutogenic approach price of junk food should be increased so that people will not think about consuming unhealthy food transportation should be made available frequently to grocery stores healthy lunch time should be added in school curriculum containing nutritious food which helps students to know more about healthy food behaviors which they can continue for further life food bank a non for profit organization that works with the entire australian food and grocery industry including farmers wholesalers manufacturers and retailers to source fresh and manufactured foods provides food for 172000 meals a day to over 2600 charities nationally food security is a complex multidimensional public health issue ranging from micro to macro level with application of red lotus model of health and well-being this presentation identifies and reports the he- public health issue at individual and environmental levels and at the same time to apply salutogenic approach and social justice perspective to analyze and have better understanding of food security